Hello, it's Paul here and welcome. My latest project has been this time inspired by Mike Walt. No, it's not a goblet and it's certainly not a Leicester goblet. It's something different. Now, probably, oh, I don't know how long ago it was now, a while ago now, Mike did a video on his channel and it, I believe it was a gift for somebody. And when I watched that, I thought, wow, really nice. Um, and it was just something that I'd just got in the back of my mind that something I wanted to have a go at at some point. And so what I used was some of this. Um, it's basically the support bars from a pallet and I mean I've just chopped it up into lengths like that um, and then got it blank from there and what I've produced this time is an ornamental miniature birdhouse really really pleased with that um, it was a bit of a nightmare to start with the main body actually took me four attempts so it's quite a steep learning curve there so the first one basically I'd drilled it, cut the size outside the size, drilled it out, it was a really really thin wall, probably less than a millimetre, decided to drill it, didn't support the inside and the whole lot just broke up to pieces. But no loss with that, I basically used that to, to test drill, to try some different types of drill bits, so um, tried forcing bits, tried the um, uh, and a couple of other types of drill bits as well. Uh, just so I could see what was the best way to do it. Second one, I think I got a split in it. Uh, the third one, uh, I made the mistake of, of, of shaping around the bottom first before I drilled out the centre uh, with a force a bit and got too close to the bottom and it's all started cracking and everything. So finally the fourth one got on, made like a jam chuck to put the whole thing on. So it's fully supported, drilled the main hole, um, I mean the, the smaller hole wasn't quite so bad anyway just because it's such a small drill piece anyway but the top straight off first time was a bit of a bit of a I would prefer it be like that slightly bigger um, probably about another five mil wider or something like that at the most uh, just to, to, just to cover it up a bit more but really really pleased with it and also I think what I had to do with the top when I'm um, when I created a jam chuck for it because it wouldn't stay on there I think because it's it just wouldn't grip uh, just had to put some insulation tape around it to hold in place so I could just finish the top off and polish it and everything so I've basically given that two coats of sanding sealer and this time I've just given it a couple of coats of beeswax and really really impressed with it really really nice that has actually given me another idea for a much bigger project using probably a, another birdhouse like that as part of a bigger project so hopefully something else I'll get on to later on now this is if it's your first time here I do part of regular videos I think this one is probably about the third project I've done this week and for my regular subscribe existing subscribers thank you very much for watching um, please do hit the like button the share button and certainly below leave some comments I do do try and reply to every comment that I can and certainly always welcome some feedback anyway so thanks a lot for watching. Bye. It's just an empty home that's on an empty street in a town that always sleeps and a blind man in the darkness knows no difference but I have grown accustomed to Colors that you bring I check the dial tone On the telephone But when I try to speak The reception gets so weak I 
Stand. 
hand in I would never mind it Sit and stare or say a prayer For all you left behind Call me just never be the last one left in line oh.
been sleeping with the lights on Buried in regrets, breaking into sweats Naked as a falling leaf Well, it's a natural reaction Driven to distraction Quiet, the ghosts will never meet Oh, and I don't know where they go When they vanish in the corners of my eyes And I don't know why, I don't know If they stay below or rise up to the sky But I'm letting go I'm letting go It's a history that never really grows I'm letting go, I'm letting go It's a silent wind that never really blows I'm letting go I'm a slave without a master Heading for disaster Kicking up the dust in the middle of the road I've been waiting on a free ride Ticket to a seaside Thicket on the edge of Puget Sound and There I'll sit I'll admit That I was only just a guest Inside my skin And by the dawn I'll be gone and won't be holding on to anything again I'm letting go, I'm letting go It's a history that never really grows I'm letting go, I'm letting go It's a silence 